Yo, 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 what's up, Kawasaki Diary, you know what I'm saying? So today's the day I'm going to go pick up my Kawasaki out the shop. It's been in there for a minute, getting modded out and upgraded and everything. So here we go. Let's go get it. Today's the day, y'all. Motor vlog time. Oh, yeah, baby. Here we go. Here we go. Anyway, while I'm waiting for the rain to stop, let me uh, show you a little bit of my setup, what I'm about to do. All right, hold on. Let's, 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 let's watch this. All right, so I have my Sadichi helmet and everything. Uh, a lot of people don't like Sadichi. They're saying it's a, not a good brand and it's Cycle Gear's house brand and Revzilla's house brand, but uh, I rock with it because I crashed in some Sadichi gear with my very, very first bike out on Boston in the turnpike, going like 70 miles per hour, uh, couldn't count and steer and negotiate the turn. And I'm alive because of that gear. You know, bike like leaned up against the guardrail and everything. My total, that whole bike, my very first bike I ever had, it was a Ninja 250, had it for like about like a half hour before I totaled it. Anyway, so we got the little drop down visor piece right here. That drops down for the um so i won't have to be changing shields out and face shields i'll just put like some shades on or whatever or drop that down and then i got this right here so instead of like you know messing up the front of my helmet with like some glue glue in the gopro mount on uh this it basically straps onto any helmet and i can take it off at will if i don't feel like motor vlogging i could just remove it without messing up the helmet and the helmet still be looking nice and I can switch it from helmet to helmet. So, I all right, without going into detail, the reason I chose this jacket, Sadiji as well, because it matches my Sadiji pants, the same pants that um, I crashed in. Obviously not the same one, but the same brand. Um, the pants has the, uh, matching pants has the hip armor that I put in there, knee armor, aftermarket hip armor, aftermarket knee armor that I put in there, um, level CE level two armor. So what I like about this jacket right here is that this jacket already comes with CE Level 2 armor. The only thing I had to do was add the uh, CE Level 2 backpack. I mean, back pad, excuse me, because it came with like a foam back pad. So I upgraded with a I stuffed the Alpine Star uh, upgraded CE Level 2 backpack in it. Um, but as you can see, it's all white, matches the helmet. Matches the uh, the white pants. Well, the pants are black, but it has white markings on there. So I'm Sadiji down to this year. I rock with Sadiji. I don't care. You know, I'm not a gear snob or whatever like that. It, it works for me. So that's how we roll in this year. So um, that's it. Wow, it is really coming down out there now, man. I might have to postpone this pickup. Jeez, why, Lord? Why, 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 why? I have to wait till tomorrow to do this. It's a shame, too, because I'm ready to vlog, man. I'm ready to do this. Oh, Lordy, Lord. Hey, everything happens for a reason, y'all. Shoot, since it's, so, since it's still raining... One more piece of equipment I forgot, which is very important, the backpack. Out of all my gear, this is the high-vis gear, because this is on my back, and this is for people coming up behind me and everything, or on the road. This is the most visible thing of my gear. My gear is all white, but this is like high-vis. This is an Icon backpack. I forget the model. I'll put it here on the screen, and uh, you can find it on the description. Now, my boy, Mr. 300 O to the G, link right there, his channel. He ain't got me a backpack for my wedding gift, the same backpack he has, which I still use, but I've been using that more as a utility, utility, utility. I've been using that more to haul my stuff in, non-motorcycle related, like luggage, like, like I be taking trips with that thing, like putting clothes and stuff in there, even though it's a motorcycle backpack and like uh, I'll still use it occasionally. But this right here, I got for the high-vis quality. 
you know what I mean? So, uh, plus uh, I work at night too. So if I'm riding at night, com commuting to work, whatever, I need some visibility. That's like another safety net for me right there. So bada boom, bada bing. Shout out to you, Mr. 300 OG. Love you, bruh. My dude came to my wedding, yo. Yeah. Shout out to Cypher Cruiser. Um, this was staring me in the face on the table, so I might as well mention it. Maybe it's for a reason, but anyway. Uh, you know how like you park your bike at your parking spot at work or whatever like that, or you park your bike and like you at a cafe somewhere or you chilling and you get back to your bike on a hot summer day and it be the seat be hot and like the, the leather seat be like, you know, the the, the the control everything be all hot and nasty or whatever, or, or bugs be sitting on there or whatever like that, or you know, it's just very uncomfortable to get back on a bike on a hot summer day. Well, uh, I was watching Psycho Cruiser on one of his earlier videos, and he advertised this half cover right here that could fit in the fanny pack, or if it could fit in your backpack, and I'm be carrying it too because I work at night, and then when I get off in the morning, you know, sometimes it'd be dew on the seat, like I'm talking about my former bikes, it'd be dew on the seat or whatever like that, that morning dew, or if it's a hot day, it could be 80 degrees at like 7.30 in the morning here and stuff like that. And, you know, so boom, this half cover right here. And um, boom, this is, it breaks down into this. Easily stuff this in your backpack. And it's not a full cover. You know, just that half cover thing just to keep the seat and your controls and stuff nice. And by the boom, by the binkskis. So, yeah. And it's, I got the uh, the silver version, the reflecting silver, kind of like the flecked the heat and the sun and all, everything. So, boom. motor vlogs baby I'ma ride this one until the until the power runs out meaning I'm in PA I'm on my way to Jersey and I'm gonna be taking the highway the whole time the interstate and I'm gonna just let this camera run out I'm gonna let this camera run out so I may be talking I may not be talking just Enjoy the view. I'll cut this up when I get home. However, it gets cut up, chopped up. So uh, we'll see what happens. But as of right now, let's ride, baby. I changed the camera. I mean, not camera. Well, yeah, I changed the camera angle. I changed my mic setup instead of going through like a separate audio uh, with the uh, had an audio device in my inside pocket going directly to the helmet and like I didn't use the camera audio on my last video and it came out the sound came out kind of subpar to be honest with you so now I'm going directly into the GoPro and I changed the mic placement as well to kind of cut out on the wind noise so we'll see how this works we'll see what happens with this I don't know what's going on 
you never know. Who knows until, you know, you play around with it a couple of times. Like I said, all my gear is new from uh, the last couple of seasons. New helmet, new mic. Camera's the same. Bike is different, as you can see. So, uh, you know, sometimes you got to play around with the audio a little bit to see what sticks. So, you know, right now, I was trying to get a little bit of an earlier start, but uh, the sun is going down, so let's do this. I want to try to get footage of the Delaware Water Gap while it's still light. So, uh, let's see if we can get that, y'all. Let's see if we can get that. So, right now, I am chilling. These mirrors suck. And, um... Yeah, life is good, life is good, life is good, life is good. That's all I got to say, life is good. Barry life is good, check. Bike life is good, check. Family life is good, check. Most important of all, God is good, check, check, check. Hold on here, got a crazy turn right here. I'm really taking it easy on this bike though because I got to get used to this sucker I'm gonna talk about that in a minute about this bike you know what I'm saying I'm gonna talk about that in a second as of right now though I gotta get to where I'm going first uh, I love this bike because of the power and the brakes the super sport I feel very comfortable with this bike because um that was sketchy I didn't see that like column in the middle of the road right there that was sketchy this road is sketchy jeez yeah so oh I'm glad he didn't pull out in front of me that would have sucked Yeah, man. Ah, these turn signals do not cancel. I do not like that. I do not like the fact that they do not cancel. I be taking these corners like a little girl because I be seeing videos of people spinning out. And these are brand new tires, so you know. Hey. It is what it is. I'm gonna be a little girl for a couple of months. There's a lot of wind right now. Who knows if you're gonna even be hearing me with this wind noise in the helmet. I don't know, vlogging kinda sucks sometimes, but maybe it's coming out good, who knows? Who really knows at this point? Maybe I should close these vents? Will that help? I don't know. I don't know. I do not know, my friend. I was in the wrong gear like crazy, but it worked out though. I'm not trying to catch him. I'll let him go. There's a bike up there. But uh, the way it sounds, it sounds like it's a uh, parallel twin. Probably a Ninja 400. I'm not into racing right now. I'm just into surviving. <laughs> I'm into getting used to this bike. Yeah, that's pretty much it right now. Oh, this lane closes. It turns into one lane. I forgot. Yep, I forgot about that. Alright, let me ease off the throttle a little bit and get me a little space cushion. He seems to be turning. God bless his soul. Taking a sweet time though. Alright, can I make this light? Yes, I can make this light. Okay. Cool. Alright, we good. Here's the wind noise picking up. What can I do? What can I say? This wind noise. 
it comes with the business. What can I say? Looks like, yeah, it looks like we're probably going to be doing a little bit of night riding. Which is cool with me. First time for everything. First time bike riding on a new bike. Hey. Please pass me, sir. I don't like how you up on me. Alright, we good. He's good. This bike is very comfortable for a super sport. I like that. Alright, highway time coming up. Not this entrance, the next one. Alright, y'all. Come on, don't do me dirty. Oh, don't do me dirty. Oh yeah, this turn right here, you gotta be careful on this joint. It's like a hairpin turn or something. I don't know. Brand new tires, easy. Easy on the throttle. Easy on the throttle. Uh, no target fixation. Look through the turn, slow press and roll and all of that jazz. Okay, easy, 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 easy. Mirror time, what's going on behind me? Alright, I'm gonna let him go. 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 Oh, okay. Highway time. Bust it. I'm a monster. I really gotta get used to it. 